And now closer to home, people in Margate, New Jersey, rallied together working to try to save their beach. They're now protesting against the federal decision to continue with a 127-mile dune project. As Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Nieves discovered, residents say the project is causing serious issues, especially when it storms. An SOS on the beach in Margate, this call though to save the shore. Well, over 100 Margate residents united at this Sunday afternoon rally, first singing, then chanting. The rally comes after a federal judge decided on Thursday to once again allow the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers to continue with a 127-mile-long dune project on beaches across the state's coastline. The project was proposed by Governor Chris Christie after Superstorm Sandy as an effort to better protect the shores. But in Margate, residents feel... Basically, the government has come in and tried to fix a problem that didn't exist and caused a problem. In recent weeks, the dunes have caused street water drainage issues. In the coastal city and after storms, large pools of water that used to drain into the ocean collected and settled now between the dune area and the bulkheads, this potentially creating a public health hazard. If we did it as private citizens did what the Armored Corps of Engineers did, we'd be in jail. The federal judge's recent ruling is firm and likely final. What we want to accomplish today is let anyone who backed this project know that we are not happy with them. And come November in election time, we're going to make sure that they get voted out of office. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers sent us a statement saying short-term solution to the drainage issue is to have contractors start adding sand to the area between the bulkheads and the dunes to elevate it. A long-term solution may only be figured out after this project is complete. Engineers saying that to leave this area like this midpoint would only make the beaches more vulnerable if a hurricane struck. In Margate, Alicia Nieves, CBS3 Eyewitness News.